will work. Only God's plan for salvation will work. Holding grievances is an attack. Salvation Only God's plan for salvation will work Only God's plan for salvation will work Lesson 86 from A Course in Miracles These ideas are for review today Only God's plan for salvation will work and holding grievances is an attack on God's plan for salvation Only God's plan for salvation will work. It is senseless for me to search wildly about for salvation. I have seen it in many people and in many things, but when I reached for it, it was not there. I was mistaken about where it is. I was mistaken about what it is. I will undertake no more idle seeking. Only God's plan for salvation will work, and I will rejoice because His plan can never fail. These are some suggested forms for applying this idea specifically. God's plan for salvation will save me from my perception of this. This is no exception in God's plan for my salvation. Let me perceive this only in the light of God's plan for salvation. Holding grievances is an attack on God's plan for salvation. Holding grievances is an attempt to prove that God's plan for salvation will not work, yet only His plan will work. By holding grievances, I am therefore excluding my only hope of salvation from my awareness. I would no longer defeat my own best interest in this insane way. I would accept God's plan for salvation and be happy. Specific applications for this idea might be in these forms. I am choosing between misperception and salvation as I look on this. If I see grounds for grievances in this, I will not see the grounds for my salvation. This calls for salvation, not attack. Salvation mm-hmm.
And now for the reflection on Lesson 86. The idea that we have searched for salvation in so many places through so many people probably rings true for each and every single one of us. It certainly does for me. Whether it be a loved one, a career, or even something less like a house or a vacation. The idea that something will save us, that something will even make us happy in a continued way, in a permanent way. But what we are learning here is that only God's plan for salvation will work. And what is God's plan for salvation? Quite simply, at least in these lessons, to give up grievances. Because grievances are blocking you from God's plan for salvation. Your grievances against anyone makes this world and everything that they have done to you real, at least in your mind, in your imagination. Withdrawing those grievances, forgiving instead... Seeing the real world instead of the world of illusions allows you to see that your salvation is at hand. It is happening right now. It always has been. It is but for you to say yes, to get out of the way, to stop judging and having grievances, instead to forgive, to relax, and to allow. To allow the Holy Spirit to have its way with you. Wouldn't that be amazing? to allow the Holy Spirit to have its way with you so that your own consciousness of I am will spring forward and then you can see resolutely that only God's plan for salvation actually does work.